I'm here on the NYSE trading floor with Maya Dorado and Connor Dwyer. The last time you saw these two, they were in bathing suits in Rio, winning medals for Team USA. Great to see you guys here and congrats to you both. Thank you, thanks, thanks. for having us. We're excited to be here. How was it to ring the bell? It was very fun, very loud. Um, I was a little nervous up there, but... <laughs> Yeah, it was a, a cool experience. It was loud. We just didn't want to mess up. Yeah. <laughs> I can't believe you two would be nervous about anything after watching you perform in Rio. Uh, Maya, let me go to you first. You know, it's different as we watch you guys swim. What was, for you, the shining moment? Was it that backstroke victory or was it something else? Well, the backstroke was amazing, obviously, and very unexpected, but I think one of the highlights for me was being on the relay with the team. I never thought I would be able to be on a U.S. relay at night, um, swimming in for Katie Ledecky, so that's something that uh, I will remember for the rest of my life. And Connor, same question for you. What was your personal highlight? Again, uh, same type of relay, just getting together with three three guys and representing your country. There's there's really no greater experience in the world than, than getting on a relay and, and swimming for Team USA. Yeah, it was amazing really watching the whole team this year. Um, Maya, and that's why I'm so surprised. You said this is going to be your last Olympics. <laughs> what are you doing? You're way too young to retire. So my first and last Olympics, um, it could not have gone any better. And I am I was so excited, excited to have that experience. Um, but I'm going to take a few months and kind of decompress and process everything. And then I start at McKinsey in January. Well, good luck to you for that. And Connor, what about you? What's next for you? I'll take a few weeks off and get back into training for Tokyo. <laughs> What's the hardest thing about training that kind of like a lay person doesn't realize? Oh, well, I mean, it's a four-year cycle, and, and we really do start training hard right off the bat. So um, that four- to five-hour grind can get tough uh, on year one or two, but uh, it makes it worth it when it goes well like it did last time. What's the best thing you've heard or seen tweeted since you guys have been back in terms of a congratulatory message? Wow, great question. Um, there was a lot of love and support when we were over there. They did an incredible job of the coverage, and um, we definitely felt the love uh, from the tweets to the text messages, WhatsApps. Yeah. I think um, when my teammate Simone Manuel won the 100 freestyle, just to see the support and everybody's excitement for her, she had tweets and Instagrams from LeBron and from Serena Williams, and so it was, it was just amazing to see the country just support her. Were you guys looking at social media while you were there? Oh uh, yeah, a little bit. Yeah. 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 It was all good things. Like it wasn't there were no there were no haters. Everyone was just so supportive and so you kind of fed off that energy. A lot of the headlines of course had to do with Michael Phelps and what happened um, with the team overall and him in particular and then there was Ryan Lochte of course. What what are fans going to remember from this Olympics? The positive or the not so positive? Yeah. I think the positive. Um, what what we accomplished over there, I don't know it's, if it's ever been done by any U.S. team. So I'm thinking uh, the memories and, and all the medals that we won. Yeah, same. I hope people remember the good stuff because it was an incredible meet. And for that to be Michael's last go round, Katie's kind of first real big moment in the in the spotlight, and for her to deliver like that was just amazing. And how heavy are the medals? They're. Can I feel it? Yeah. I'm sorry. I've, We've oh heard my God, they're 1.1 like, pounds. Yeah. yeah. I'm surprised you aren't like this, leaning over. It's uh, great. Well, I hope you guys don't take those off for a while, really. Um, congratulations to you both. It was amazing watching you during the Olympics. Great to talk to you now. Thank you very much. Thank Thanks. you. Thank you.